In today's video, I'm going to share with you probably something that I shouldn't share with you, but I really, really want to just because I think it's so powerful. And to be quite honest with you, I think the community will probably patch it. Um, but I want my community to know about this um, just so that you know, you know, you, this is an option. I didn't invent this play by any means. This uh, came across my... Uh, my feed this was from gold rush i was uh late last night i was just kind of searching seeing what people were doing now for those of you that don't know me my name is cody and i make videos on youtube that are designed to help you get better at madden but one of the things that i'm known for at least or that uh most of the players know if you've picked up my offensive ebook I really, really like the air raid offense. I really like coach Mike Leach. Um, he's had a huge influence on me. And so I run Arizona Cardinals offensive playbook. But a couple of months ago, right when I was first getting back into YouTube, one of my guys, um, his name is Brian Buttons, who is a phenomenal offensive mind, great offensive mind. And I personally have learned a lot from him. He was telling me that you should check out the spread playbook. And honestly, I gave the spread playbook a run, but I really didn't dive deep into it like I should have. And to be quite honest with you, um, I didn't like the fact that they didn't have as much mesh, as much as many mesh concepts as the air raid from the Arizona Cardinals playbook had. Fast forward to 2021 or Madden 21. And... The mesh is not as effective as it's been in the past, at least in my opinion. Man-to-man -man coverage with the way it plays. Uh, corner routes don't beat man like they used to. You know, different things like that. And so, late last night, saw this video. And honestly, with the way QB draw works, with the way QB runs work in general, the spread playbook has the best quarterback runs in the game quarterback runs until they fix it and i don't know that they're going to fix it i don't know that i don't know what madden is going to do but this year a hundred percent i want to be very very upfront and tell you that the best way to run the ball in madden 21 in my personal opinion is to run counters or to run with the quarterback those are the two best most effective ways power blocking schemes work 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 this year and so the best playbook for shotgun runs is by far the spread playbook. And so, especially for the quarterback. So uh, I want to show you this video again, gold rush found this. This is not my tip, but gold rush is a phenomenal lab or someone that I look to and I learn from. And I just wanted to share this. This is his find. Uh, at least I, as far as I know, um, it's a very glitchy play, but it's very effective. And I just, you know, I just feel like um, I need to share this with my guys so that we can begin working on a solution to this, right? Um, but anyway, the play is from Gunflex. And what you'll find here, the play is motion counter. And if I run this, you'll see that it's basically a counter run, right? If I just run it stock, you see here, it's a counter run, just like it's supposed to be. Watch what happens whenever I flip the play. All I'm going to do at the line of scrimmage is I'm going to flip the play. And what you'll notice is everything looks the same, but you'll see a very, very different outcome. So I'm going to flip the play, and Lamar Jackson is just going to run. And you see that I can run either way with Lamar. It kind of glitches out the defense. I personally like to flip it at the line of scrimmage. I don't like to just come out and it flipped. You can also do that. I like to flip it at the line of scrimmage because if you flip it at the line of scrimmage, what you're going to see here is Lamar actually has a shot at running left. And I think running left with this is really, really good. He gets a complete speed burst and turbo. Defense doesn't react at all. You know, this is, like I said, this is one of the best quarterback runs. And you can actually, you don't have to run it outside. That's the thing. Um, and if you actually lab this run up a little bit, you can run it straight forward. You see that right there? So when I'm on the goal line, and this is why it kind of pricked me a little bit, because one of the challenges that I have is I feel like my offense is really good from the 20 yard line to the 10 yard line. But once I get in the red zone, once I get in the goal line, it can be a little bit stingy down there. It can be a little bit hard to score because you can run up the middle so well. It's fat. It's you, you literally the the run play works is the fastest, at least that I know of. It's the fastest run play that you can get. Like as far as like him getting through the hole fast, it's borderline impossible to use her. And literally he's going to go right through. And I can almost guarantee you, if you run this play inside, you know, fourth and inches situations, some of those short yardage situations, this is a great play to mix in. Again, this is not the best. I mean, I think it's the best run in the game. But again, it's not unstoppable. There's things that the defense can do to stop this. I do want to be clear about that. Um, 
but it's not easy. It's not easy to stop it. And that's, that's to me the key. I don't know that this is, um, I don't know that this is something like, you know, if you do this in CFMs, you're probably going to get shamed or whatever. But to me, like if you're playing weekend league and mutt, this is a great, this is a great thing to add to your offense. And, you know, you could say, well, this is cheesy or this is whatever. Um, and let me just, let me just kind of speak to that a little bit. Yeah, it is kind of cheesy. You know, I don't think you can say it's not. It's kind of cheesy. It's kind of glitchy. But again, EA Sports, right? It's in the game. They've put this in the game. You need to know this is in the game. You need to begin working on a solution to this because people are going to run this. This thing's going to blow up. I'm telling you right now, um, I, I saw a couple of other people already starting to, it's going to make its way around YouTube. You know, people are going to start to see this run. I just wanted my followers, the people that are really, um, you know, maybe they only watch my channel. Maybe they don't watch Gold Rush. Maybe they don't watch some of the other channels that have covered this. Um, I just wanted my people to be aware that this is a thing. And as a community, we need to work on a defense for it. We need to work on a solution because where, where I'm sitting right now, this is way better than quarterback draw. This is way better than quarterback draw. And most people would say quarterback draw is too hard to stop. This run right here is insanely hard to stop because it's really hard to user it. Basically, what I would recommend doing is blitzing your corners off the slot edges and then, you know, basically coming through the A-gap with your user. Because I think what people miss about this run, most people only focus on the fact that you can go out to the right or you can go out to the left. You get complete control of your quarterback, especially if you run with like a Lamar Jackson, maybe you put fast break on him or whatever. Um, you get complete control of your quarterback. So I can literally, I could just wait and then let, and then go if I wanted to do that. I don't have to jet to the left or the right. I can also literally instantly go right down the middle. To me, those are very, very effective um, tactics for this run. You know, so I just wanted to share this with you again. I saw this on YouTube last night. Honestly, I like I said, I look up to Gold Rush a lot. I think Gold Rush has a really, really solid pulse on some of the most effective way uh, tactics. Um, he did a video that I saw that was very, very effective for man beating and some of the like the high level tips that that I look for. You know, Gold Rush is kind of one of those guys that's always on the cutting edge, and so uh, he's just a good labber. That's what it comes down to. You know, Ant Cap from Huddle.gg, Gold Rush. Those are two guys to me that have had big time influences on me. Um, and, you know, they've taught me a lot. Again, part of Madden, you learn from other people. And so, you know, it's a copycat league. I just wanted to share this with you. I think this is very effective. The spread playbook, and this is really the bigger picture of why I wanted to share this with you. I think the spread playbook might be, and it, it's, it's, I don't want to say this because the Arizona offense is so good, but the spread playbook is right there and it's right there for different reasons. You know, it's not the same. They're not the same offenses, but if you want a little bit more run heaviness of it, the spread playbook is really good. In my opinion, it's ironic to me that spread is more run heavy than Arizona, but the runs you get in Arizona are good. They're just not as good as the runs you get in the spread playbook. So I just want to encourage you to check it out. Also, if you guys are, um, maybe you're, maybe you watch this video, maybe you've never seen anything that we do here. Uh, I stream every night at 10 o'clock on, tw on uh, Twitch and YouTube. Those links are in the description. But I also want to encourage you right now, if you have never uh, joined a texting membership, basically what this is, it's very, very simple. The texting membership is you text me at the phone number that you see on your screen, or it's also in the description. It's 812-216-3644. So you text me and you just let me know that you want to join. That's all you got to do. Shoot me your name. Shoot me, you know, you say what's up, whatever. It is my personal cell phone number. There's no game here. There's no, you know, whatever. This this is my personal cell phone number that I talk to my wife on, right? There's no, 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 uh, you know, no like Google voice or none of that, right? This is straight up my phone. I want you to know that because what I'm trying to do what I'm trying to accomplish here on YouTube is I'm trying to give you as much access to me as you possibly can because I want to truly help you get better. That's my goal. I'm not trying to, you know, I'm not trying to do anything but that here at this channel. So my encouragement to you is shoot me a text because we just produced, I just designed a one hour, almost one hour, just under an hour video showing you how to stop every single run in Madden 21. Every single popular run that you'll face, stretch, dive, 0-1 trap, buck sweep, 
counter, power O, fullback dive, QB draw, every single popular run, I have released a video that shows you how to stop every single run. It goes into detail on it. And so, but that video is not public. It's not public to my YouTube members. It's not public to my Discord members. It's not public to uh, my followers or any of that. You have to join the text message membership to be able to get that. So I'd love to give that to you. It's completely free. All you got to do is just text me and let me know you want to receive that video. So other than that, guys, I want to thank you for your time today. We're going to show you a ton of more stuff this week from the spread playbook. We're going to do a little bit of a deep dive into that this week. So I'd encourage you to subscribe because we're going to show you how to not just run this one little play here. How do you build an entire offense from spread? And I can tell you right now, um, the spread playbook is by far one of the most unique offenses and really does lend itself, especially with the way this year's game is being played, to helping you beat some of the meta defenses that you're going to face. So if you want to get more of those kind of videos, I'd encourage you to subscribe. We're going to probably do a video next in our next week's text membership about uh, pass defense. And then I think the week after that, we'll give a, uh, a, a mini scheme from the spread. So a lot of really, really good stuff coming to the channel. We have a couple more videos today that are going to go live. And I also do want to invite you to our, we are uh, our daily live streams. Like I said, I stream every single night at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time on Twitch and on YouTube and on Facebook, okay? And the best way to know when I go live is to join the Discord. Discord is a great place. Like I said, you know, I didn't create this tip. I found this from somebody else. I learned this from somebody else, right? Discord allows you to do that. Mm -hmm. It allows you to get together with a community of like minded like interested people and then learn about the game people that may be better than you people that may not be as good as you that you can help that's what we're trying to accomplish we're trying to help everybody get better and the best way to get better there's two ways number one get coached right number one get coached i got coached by gold rush for this video right here number two give coaching i'm coaching all of my followers right now to to, to, to check this video out influence coaching relationships that's what we do here i want to thank you so much for your time i hope you enjoyed the video i hope it was helpful and shoot me a text let me know and if you have ever if you ever have a madden question at all text me text me text me text me i am doing my best to get better at responding within 24 hours sometimes it's 48 to it's sometimes it's two to three days please forgive me for that but i am know that i am working on trying to get that get better at that um so that i can serve you guys better i really really appreciate you guys uh we just crossed 13,000 uh subscribers which i'm proud of that and we're going to continue to push forward and continue to try to help more people get better at madden 21 thank you